We uh, run an annual um, apprentice pre-selection test um, here in Victoria. Um, we've just done it here in um, uh, about a week ago uh, and 500 young people uh, sit this um, um, pre-selection test. The idea behind the test is that um, um, it gives both the young person and indeed prospective employers um, some sense of whether or not um, they've got the capability to undertake the, uh, the off the job or the, uh, the TAFE component of, uh, of the apprenticeship training. There's also a new program that started in selected secondary schools in Victoria. We also have a program, um, a vehicle electrical program, uh, which um, is a program uh, where we take some subjects from the pre-apprenticeship stream and the apprenticeship uh, course and uh, we deliver it to um, we tailor it to deliver it to secondary school students so if there are any uh, secondary school students who are interested uh, in this industry they should talk to their careers coordinators and um, ask if they would uh, be eligible to attend a VCAL electrical course. Another program like this is offered by Williamstown High School in partnership with Victoria University of Technology TAFE Division and the Electrical Trades Union. The school offers students an innovative curriculum involving trades. A lot of kids being forced up the VCE stream and there was no other alternative and quite frankly not everyone and I was the same is really uh, wanting to pursue an academic career. We want to look at something different. There wasn't anything for kids in those options so the union with Willie High created a program that you could do pre-apprenticeship as part of your VCE outcome and it steered some kids that were suited into trades and it was very successful and I think the state government learned from that modified the way school training is done and now you can get access to some components of uh, trade work at school which is a great thing. How much time does an apprentice spend at work and how much time do they spend at school? I personally spend four days a week at work uh, and then one day a week at trade school. Alternatively, uh, depending on the employer's preference, uh, you can do trade school in block release which is basically one week a month at trade school. So what sort of subjects do you study at school? A lot of the core material for the trade, trade schooling is uh, based around physics, maths, electronics um, and sort of how it's applied practically as opposed to theor theoretically. So. It's actually quite amazing how quickly what you learn at school becomes relevant to what you're doing on a day to day basis um, and it's also good you can take back experiences you have on the job and you know we have discussions at school and um, um, have chat with the teachers about you know what's happening on the job and and are we doing the right thing, why do we do this and sometimes it's nice just to have that extra time to have someone explain it to you. They uh, do more and more um, I suppose uh, applications of electricity and all of the different uh, accessories that there are involved and the different components that could uh, increase or decrease electrical quantities and so forth. Basically what we learn here is uh, common to all, all the fields. We get a good grounding in everything. Uh, we're taught everything we need to know. Um, it's just a matter of how you apply, apply that on the job, whether it be to the domestic, commercial or industrial field. The theory behind it's all the same.